Good afternoon and welcome everyone. I'm Linda Berg, the president of the Ann Arbor Youth Corral. And on behalf of all the board of directors, we want to welcome you here this beautiful afternoon. It did turn out to be a beautiful day. Uh, and this is certainly a beautiful setting to sing in. It's beautiful acoustics so the children can perform their very best here and you can hear them very clearly. Uh, we have a couple of announcements and I will try to be really, really brief. This is our last concert of the season and it has been a really wonderful season. Parents, please, please, please check the newsletter that will come out tomorrow for all those last minute instructions about returning music and uniforms. Um, we are asking that the uniforms come back on hangers to expedite that whole process. We have a number of people that way beyond the conductors and accompanists who give of their time to ensure the success of Ann Arbor Youth Corral throughout the year. I just want to take a couple of minutes to recognize them. First, we have two choir coordinators who look after our children at every rehearsal and every event, of which there have been many events. So I want to recognize Julia Chu and Brenda Slim in particular, and their assistants, Laura and Megan. We have a board of directors that is an entirely volunteer work board, and I would like just, I'm not going to name the board members because they're all in your program, if they would just stand up and be recognized. Board members, please. Up in the balcony is Mr. Kidd. Wave at us, Bob. Okay, there he is. And he's videotaping this, and so that if you have a family member who can't be here today, they eventually will be able to see all of the songs on YouTube. Um, and so we thank Bob for videotaping every one of our concerts. Now, we've had a busy uniform committee this year because the kids have sung so much. Yay. That's headed up by Mary Fallon and Susie Stein. Would you two stand up, please? <laughs> I ask you particularly to stand up because on Monday and Tuesday, we will be collecting the uniforms back, and they need some extra assistance. So if any of you are going to be around for Monday and Tuesday at Huron High School, during rehearsal time, would you please um, see Susie or Mary after the rehearsal so that you can maybe help them a little bit. It really just entails having extra hands to, to gather in those beautiful uniforms that we know everyone loves. Uh, now, we have an amazing, and I do mean this, cohort of parent volunteers that have helped with concerts, snacks, fundraising, game night, and all sorts of things that happen behind the scene. I would like every parent that has contributed in some way to one of those things I just named, which covers a gamut, to stand up and be recognized. Every parent that has helped us. Jennings and Mrs. Baldwin, who make all this beautiful music happen with your children. 